Um, what up? Um, I heard, okay, I, I, heard, I just seen the video for Better Run Run by um, MC Ham. It's supposed to be this disc going towards Jay-Z, alright? And here's my issue with this whole thing. Why is MC Hammer dissing Jay-Z? I don't get that right now. Okay, Jay-Z said about a bar or two about MC Hammer's finances and stuff, okay? But show me how many rappers have done that over the last 10 years, 15 years, you know? I mean, it's just idiotic to me that MC Hammer, who's nearly 50 and supposed to be a preacher, is even doing this. It's kind of ironic because that's what preachers don't do, you know? Somebody talks bad about them, they usually don't, you know, respond. But thing is, MC Hammer's been, I mean, it's been going on for years. Jay-Z is not not the first rapper to do this okay and i'm damn sure he won't be the last but let's be honest i mean come on <sighs> mm. mc hammer hasn't been musically relevant in nearly in nearly 20 years okay his peak he hasn't hit his peak in 20 years okay please hammer don't hurt which was his landmark groundbreaking album you know first rap album to sell 10 million almost 20 over 20 million sold one of the best selling rap albums if not the best selling rap album of all time and he and I mean the dude was just everywhere I mean he's on taco commercials cartoons dolls you name it I can't think of a rapper before him that has had any of that but it's just that you know, I mean, what Jay-Z was saying was true. He lost $30 million. He lost all your money. Literally. And he want to go against Jay for I mean, for what? I mean, look. Dipsy Hammer hasn't been musically relevant in years. Jay-Z has been musically relevant since his first album, which came out in 96. And, I mean, okay, let's be honest. He put out some, he put out some great albums, classic albums, and he put out some albums that were not so classic or just bad altogether. But this, I mean, the fact that MC Hammer is dissing Jay, I mean, I don't get the merit or the basis or anything. You know? I mean, you know, they're both, Jay, they're both in their 40s, okay? MC Hammer's 48, Jay-Z's be 41 next month, okay? But... I mean, the fact that him is, it's just stupid to me. It really is. You're a preacher. Why are you going against Jay-Z? And plus, he's in the video, he's using... I mean, first of all, here's the start. The video sounds like a radio single. I'm, the diss sounds like a radio single. Most disses don't sound like radio singles, you know. And they shouldn't. And there's a lot of dancing in the video, pop lock and whatever. You know, all that old dancing that Hammer used to do years ago. You know? And... I... And I'm like, it's, it's hard to take this this seriously. And he plus he had the devil reference, you know, he had the devil running, chasing the so-called Jay-Z imposter or whatever through the forest and everything. And I'm like, what? Uh, I mean, come on. Like, where haven't we heard this before? Okay, there's like hundreds of YouTube videos, hundreds of people, people I, even on where I'm at that I know personally that think that Jay-Z is the devil or the Antichrist or his music is satanic or whatever. All that bullshit. But, um, I, 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 I just really don't get it, okay? I mean, is Hammer jealous or something? You know, that Jay-Z is one of two rappers who are, are worth more than a hundred, who are worth hundreds of millions of dollars into their 40, and they're, and they're over 40? I mean, somebody has to ask me, like, seri tell me, like, seriously. I mean, because, let's, it's him, I mean, there were a lot of rappers he had to diss, but you diss Jay-Z, it just makes it pointless. I mean, I don't see, I don't get it. I mean, see him hasn't been culturally or music, I mean, he hasn't been culturally or musically relevant in 20 years, or nearly 20 years, you know? So, I just, MC Hammer, then this is me directed to you, personally. Um, look. Jay is they're still musically and culturally relevant. Nearly, tw um, I mean, almost 15 years after his debut album. You going against him is not going to do anything. It's not going to help your career. It's definitely not going to hurt his. 
So you're wasting your time by dissing Jay. And if Jay does a response, I'll listen to it. But more than likely, I doubt if he does because it's just going to be him wasting his time. He's going to be wasting his time dissing you. Just let it go, man. for real.